You venture into these waters, you're not sure what you're going to find here. Uh, you are taking your life <laughs> into your own hands, that's for certain. Henrik says, hit it. Well, remember, well, Stenson's Henrik, done Henrik it. Stenson, you know he's, he's done it too. It. Would, you, would, you, would you go in the water there? <laughs> Certainly so. My partner showed me what you got to do, you know. Do you remember Doral? He's not scared of taking his pants off, so he said, get in there. Oh dear. That turtle is on the wrong end of that encounter with that alligator. Although, perhaps is he just transporting him to the lake? A gesture of goodwill? I doubt it. Oh boy. That looks like dinner to go. ball was moving on that down slope there. It is moving just a little bit. It definitely moved. It's, it's alive. alive. Yeah. Jeez. <laughs> it has hatched. Look at that. Getting closer to the hole. Hey, we need a real special with Stroud. Whatever you want, dog. If I can't get this one up and down with any club in my bag, I, umbrella. I'll get it up now. You're going to use that umbrella, Come on, dog. dog. Oh, I just whipped it. We're back and we've figured out our next big break challenge. We'll call it the swarm. See if you can strike a putt with killer bees in the area. <laughs> Look at these gophers. <laughs> Hit that deck incoming. You just don't see that every day. Graham McDowell, 89 yards away. Holes cut in the left front, water on the left. Ooh, uh oh, uh oh, 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 it's straight to the chair. All right. I'll see you on the next. Thank you very much. Talk about an up close and personal experience with nature. That's Davis Love the Third flirting he's, he's with disaster. Take, he's trying to take a picture of it. He's got his camera on his mobile phone. This was his second shot at this 18th hole on Friday. Going for the green in two. Plays what appears to be a very good looking second shot. Catches the green, but the greens were quite firm. The ball rolls through the putting surface and on a slope up against a rake. Now, he comes up and marks the ball, but inadvertently picked the ball up. You know, ordinarily, Johnny, you mark the ball and then move the rake. If the ball moves, you put it back. But since he moved the ball and actually picked it up, he was penalized a stroke and then played his fourth right into the hole for a very unlikely birdie. Can you tell us about the, the Skittles, how they were used, <laughs> the significance of them? Well, so, Adam had a bag of Skittles and he goes, anybody want a Skittle? We just made birdie. I'm like, sure, let's go. And it, it started, you know, let's go make birdies for Skittles. And we shot, what we shot, like five under on the back nine once we started doing the Skittles. So we, we felt like it worked out pretty good. Yeah. <laughs>